Hello family, welcome back to New Mongol Fluid International Ministries. This is Minister Glynn speaking. I hope you all are having a glorious day. I want to say welcome to all of our first timers as we always do. Welcome to the ministry. Please go ahead and click on the subscribe button. We don't want you to miss any of our videos here on the ministry. And to all of our returning subscribers as usual, we love to appreciate you all very much. Thank you so much for coming back to receive God's word. I hope you all have been having a, a great week. Uh, today I have a word to help some of you i pray that this word will be a blessing to majority of you in the mighty name of jesus christ of nazareth so we're gonna go into the word but let's pray first together as a family i've already prayed but i always want to carry you all together along with me heavenly father we welcome your presence one more time holy spirit we ask that you will come and saturate this atmosphere that even as i begin to minister unto your people that this word will stir up their faith to help them to believe that you are able to do exceedingly and abundantly beyond and above all that you all that they can ask or imagine in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father Lord, let this word bless the multitude today in Jesus' mighty name. We pray, Holy Spirit, speak through me tonight in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. So today I'm going to be focusing on um, the number two. The number two. The number two. And I want you all to prepare for sudden increase and multiplication because our God is a God of suddenly as we all know and our God is a God of increase and God is a God of multiplication so I want you all to understand this first of all because many of you have seen messages from you saying I've been seeing the number two a lot but I don't um, understand what that means I want you to have an understanding of why you're seeing the number two repetitively or the number four 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 okay so this is also going to be a prophetic release as well God is a God of multiplication like I've already mentioned even I myself I have been seeing the number two a lot for some time now this also means a revival is on its way for the body and even now it is happening there is a revival that has been taking place in the body of Christ and in the world as well Many of you will experience a revival in your spiritual life. Many of you will, uh, um, will experience a revival in your marriage. Many of you will also experience a revival in your health, in your body, and in your soul. As you continue to draw onto the Lord, what the Lord will um, do in your life is that He will begin to revive every area of your life, every aspect of your life, internally and externally, spiritually and physically. The more you draw near onto the Father. So if God is revealing the number two to you continuously in so many ways, He's sending you a message, He's sending you a reminder of, of what He wants to do. God always wants to, to, um, to um, multiply His people. God always wants to increase you. So you need to have faith in the Lord. And also spend time with the Lord and ask God, Father, why do I keep on seeing the number two? Because every single one of us it means something different yes god wants to multiply and increase every single one of his children but if you ask the lord if you spend time to ask the lord he can be specific as to what he wants to do in your life praise god so the revelation i keep getting about this about the number two is increase and multiplication if you uh, remember, uh, uh, if you've seen uh, the last uh, three videos I think I've, I, I've um, done recently, I mentioned in the video that I had um, going on with my husband, I mentioned that somebody was going to receive an increase in their salary. That came by leading of the Holy Spirit. Praise God. So there is going to be increase. That's the revelation that I keep getting. Increase. This is the hour of increase. We're in the season where God is increasing his people. And this is going to be for, for um, those of you that have been faithful and serving and seeking the Lord diligently. God is going to increase you. The Lord wants to increase you and multiply you. In the scripture, it says in Isaiah 61 verse 7, it says, Instead of shame and dishonor, you will enjoy a double share of honor. Instead of shame and dishonor, you will enjoy a double share of honor. Pay attention to the word double. Double represents two, not one. One plus one equals two. You will enjoy a double share of honor. You will possess a double portion of prosperity in your land and everlasting joy will be yours. This scripture is amazing, you all. I love this scripture so much because it emphasizes on the word double 
and double represents two as we all know so the lord is going to be giving you double share of honor for all those of you that have felt like you have experienced some sort of shame in your family at your job in your career in your marriage in your health many of you have been struggling physically um some of you in your health the lord is saying he's going to give you a double share of honor so all what you've experienced that look like shame and dishonor in your life the lord is coming to repay back god is coming back to actually give you a double portion of honor to cover up for all the times that you have felt or um or um, seen shame or experienced shame in your life you will possess a double portion of prosperity in your land god is all about doubling things up and multiplying his people a double portion of prosperity in your land god can just bless you with one but the Lord loves to um, do more than what you actually expect. Let's look at um, Ephesians 3.20. It says that the Lord is able to do exceedingly, as I said already, exceedingly and abundantly. That speaks volumes about that verse. That God is not just looking to do just one thing in your life, then he's done. No. God is looking to do more than one thing. More than one thing. Numerous things. Numerous things miracles numerous wonderful things in your life exceedingly and abundantly when there's only one of something there is no abundance but but then when there's more than one of something there's an abundance of that thing why because there's more than one praise god hallelujah if you pray in the holy spirit begin to pray in the holy ghost right now in the name of jesus christ i just feel led by the spirit right now to begin to pray to begin to release this word prophetically over every single one of you that you will begin to experience double blessings double breakthrough double wisdom in the name of jesus christ of nazareth i hear in my spirit the word acceleration thank you jesus i hear in my spirit the word acceleration i pray for somebody here today that you will be divinely accelerated in your career in your marriage in all that concerns you in your spiritual life your spiritual growth Karaba, e kama sha karaba de, zika mande de bosu karaba baba, rede ko sheke de bosu kamande, e kama mande de bosu sheke ya bo, raba baba sheke de bosu kama, leke tero bo sheke ya ba. Father, we thank you for double portion of your blessings for your people in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I prophesy every every single one of you right now. Listen, I prophesy over you right now that double breakthrough, double blessings, double portion of honor and glory and power and wealth and strength strength is your passion and favor is your passion in the name of jesus christ of nazareth holy spirit breathe upon your people breathe upon your people a double breath double breath of life afresh lord revive your people heavenly father in the name of jesus christ of nazareth revive the body of christ revive the world heavenly father by the power of the Holy Spirit of your spirit, Heavenly Father, multiply your people, Heavenly Father, in their job, in their homes, in their career, in their business, oh Lord, in their health, Heavenly Father. Cancer is destroyed in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Heart disease, we overcome you by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Double healing in the part of your body that you don't even know that you need healing. Receive healing right now in the name of jesus christ of nazareth every chain is broken off your life every yoke is destroyed every burden is removed in the name of jesus christ of nazareth begin to type in the comment section i receive it i receive it i receive my double i receive my double blessing i receive my double breakthrough i receive my double wisdom many of you are going to take a leap in your spiritual life there's going to be a double leap of spiritual growth you will be so surprised at yourself that you begin to pray more you'll be shocked at yourself that that they, and they begin to seek the Lord more and fast more in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth.
you receive double strength somebody here has been struggling they've been feeling so weak and so weary and so down to continue to seek the lord i don't know who that person is but in the name of jesus christ of nazareth that yoke of weakness is destroyed in jesus name because christ made himself weak for you to be strong so i decree and i declare that you are receiving strength in your bones in your mind in your soul in your body in your spirit in the name of jesus christ of nazareth be strengthened come alive in the name of jesus christ of nazareth bounce back in your faith begin to pray begin to fast begin to seek the lord in the name of jesus christ of nazareth because he will reward those that diligently seek him in jesus mighty name we pray thank you holy spirit Genesis 22 17 says indeed I will greatly bless you and I will greatly multiply your seed as the stars of the heaven and as the sun which is upon the seashore and your seed shall possess the gate of their enemies many of you are going to begin to possess places lands territories that you never ever in your life thought you would be able to take authority over that place but god is going to multiply you in such a way especially in your finances and especially in your wisdom that that, that those territories that you touch we're going to overtake you or overcome you you will begin to overtake those places you will begin to overcome those things in the name of jesus christ of nazareth be blessed you all this is god's word for you the lord wants you to trust him to do more than you expect of him in the mighty name of jesus christ of nazareth i want to say to somebody right now that hasn't given their lives to jesus christ please say this prayer of salvation we are in the end times and jesus loves you so much draw near to jesus christ today he is the way the truth and the life if you're feeling lost jesus is the way he will show you the way to where you need to get to in life say with me oh lord god i come to you today i believe that Jesus is Lord, that he died for me. He rose up on the third day to save me. Lord Jesus, I receive you. I believe you. I welcome your Holy Spirit into my spirit. I declare I am born again. I am saved in Jesus' name. Amen. Well done on saying that prayer and welcome to the family of Christ. Please get yourself a Bible and spend time with the word of God. God bless you all richly. For those that want to sow into the ministry or pay your tithe, please do so with the links in the bar below and I will see you all in the next one. Remain blessed and God loves you all very much. God bless.